at DX Radio Shop, Upstate New York, 315-573-9205. Over 35 years professionally servicing radios, both ham and CB. So on the bench today, we got that 148. Just going to do an updated video. Uh, now that we got her all set, put back together, all cleaned up. So we're going to take and see what the output looks like now. It should be... Uh, See if I can get this camera to work. There we go. I don't have time for all this camera stuff. I'm just trying to set up a new thing for everybody to watch because uh, they have so much work to do. Can't keep up with it right now. There we go. Okay, so 50 watt slug, as you can see in the bird. We have a uh, four and a half watt carrier. Audio, hello. Audio, hello. One, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. Audio, hello. Check, 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 check. It's about 18 watts, which is typical for a 148. That's pretty common for those. Sometimes you get a little more, sometimes you get a little less. But uh, the Malaysian ones are the better ones. This one is a. Uh, Actually, this one's from the Philippines. I'm surprised it's not doing a little bit better than that. Should be about 23 watts, but that's okay. But uh, right around 18, 20 watts is about average for these radios. So we have uh, a nice 142 back in good working condition, the way it should be. So um, this is a nice, uh, nice radio now. Audio, hello, audio, hello. So. I just want to do a short video clip, an updated one. Uh, this is the one we did the alignment on with the frequency that we did a video for for you guys to watch. So uh, you'll be able to uh, see that as well. And um, anybody needs radios service, let me know. Give me a holler. 315-573-9205. We service customers in over 23 states. And uh, seven different ZB shops that send their stuff up here for repair. If they can't figure it out, they usually send them here to have us fix it. So... Catch you guys later, 73.